Williams is putting some firefighters to work this morning to tell us more details. Hey, Ashley. Hi, guys. Good morning. Yes, right now we're standing in front of, as you can see, the Firefighters Burn Institute. Now, there's a lot going on here. Let's go ahead and introduce Eli. Eli, Miratos Coffee and local firefighters are coming together to help raise money for those in need. I want to talk to you specifically, though, about Miratos Coffee because people might not know it's a company really owned and operated by firefighters. Correct. So it's a firefighter owned and operated company. Uh, we take pride in giving back to the community. And so for uh, all of our sales, we donate 5% of uh, all of our sales to individuals in need, line of duty deaths and victims of fire, as well as get involved with foundations such as the Firefighter Burn Institute to make a difference within the communities in which we're serving. Yeah, and you guys are always doing such great things in the community. Now, this is something that they're doing called the Push-Up Challenge, do 10, see, well, see 10, do 10, and then donate 10. And here to talk about that is Doug. But while Doug gets ready to talk about it, I'm going to make Eli do push-ups throughout the rest of this segment because apparently he could do, seg he could do push -ups for several minutes in a row. So we're going to go ahead and keep him busy. All right, tell me, Doug, a little bit about this challenge here. So everybody's been stuck in quarantine, and the only way they can communicate is through social media. Uh, people started doing the send 10 or C10, do 10, send 10 push up challenge. Well, we raised the stakes. We wanted to encourage donations. Yeah. Um, we encourage people to do about $10 if you can. We've uh, we've donated one dollar per push up. We've done. We're almost at a thousand dollars so far. Um, and what we're going to do at the end next Sunday, we're going to release the winners, um, and we're going to fill grocery carts for families in need right now, and just That's try incredible. and do whatever we can to help out. That's incredible. Now, how do you think our guy Eli is doing over here? Well, he did 88 the first time. Uh, we've had someone do 85 and someone do 53. That's the top in male, male and female. You don't have to do push-ups to get involved. Yeah. You can donate, but if you want to do the push-ups, there's prizes involved. You know, he was being a little boastful earlier. He's like, I could do a lot of push-ups. So I think we should make him do push-ups during the rest of this interview. Tell me about the Firefighters Burn Institute and what you guys are doing for them. So the Firefighters Burn Institute works with the UC Davis Medical Center and has a burn unit, and that institute drew directly affects firefighters throughout the community, um, as well as members of the community that have any burns. And so we work with them directly to make sure that we make a difference within the community and help burn survivors and victims as they put on camps and all sorts of different things for firefighters along with uh, helping the community out. So that's what we're doing. You know, I'm gonna make you, I'll come, I'm gonna make you stop. <laughs> I feel so bad about that. Eli and Doug, thank you so much. And here this is, go ahead. If you wanna donate, our Venmo is Martos Coffee Co. Um, yeah. We're doing a promo right now too, Fresh 15. So yeah. if you do, you yeah. can get a little discount code okay, as well. Go on our uh, Instagram and our Facebook, and then check out our website at uh, MuertosCoffeeCo.com yeah. and uh, help us make a difference and give back to the community and families in need. All right, sounds good. Now, thank you so much, guys. I know every dollar goes a long way. I cannot do 88, but can I give you three push-ups? Yeah. All right, I'll do three push-ups, and that's the end of that, okay? Here we go. There you go. One, yeah. two, three. One more for good luck. Four. Five. Oh, she's going. Five. Nice work. Nice, nice work. Perfect. Thank you, guys. All right. Good job, Ashley. Good job.